Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at youtube.com slash Show. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Jamie Hess, welcome back to the Bounder BB Show as I broadcast live out of Dallas. How are you? I'm terrific. How are you? I am so, so good. I'm so glad you're here. I want my audience to know you know that Jamie is a wellness and a lifestyle expert. And she's here to give us some tips and advice on healthier daily routines. Yeah, keeping your body, mind fit, and making me time and focusing on your fitness and wellness. Jamie, that's a mouthful. So let's get started. So what makes summer a great time to reset our fitness mindset? Well, you're right. It is a mouthful and it can seem a little bit overwhelming, but I promise you it's really as simple as honing in on the thing that you like. So do you like to walk outside and get fresh air? Then that is your workout. Do you love lifting weights? Then that can be your thing, but it doesn't matter what the new hot trendy workout is. The most important thing is that it is something that you like to do. That's what will keep you coming back for more. And I always say this to my coaching clients, three days a week of sweaty cardio is a really great place to start. That's going to be mindful of your cardiovascular health and to make sure you're kind of getting into fat burning mode. But I have to also say this, and this is so important, Valder. So when you are working out a lot and you are sweating in your gym clothes, I have to say that there's actually a recent study done by Clorox that showed that clothes washed in laundry detergent alone that were sweaty from workouts had as many strains of bacteria on them as a toilet handle. So, yeah. <laughs> so gross, right? So it's that so is. Gross. It's so gross. So it's so important when you're when you're done working out that you get out of your workout clothes and you take something like I like to use their Clorox fabric sanitizer. You take it, you spray a little bit on your clothes, on say your leggings or your sweaty workout top and you let it sit for five minutes before putting it in the wash. That's going to kill up to 99.9% of odor causing bacteria. And that is what's gonna make all the difference. Okay, so where do you start? You know, people see me walking and riding my bike. I've returned to my summer routine, right? And people say, yeah, stop by and pick me up. (laughs) You know, like, okay. Or let me know when you're going walking. Where do they get started? Right. Well, it's so hard to find motivation sometimes. And probably if I hear one thing more than anything on NYC Fit Fam, which is my Instagram account, and this is where people reach out to me literally by the hundreds every day. And they say, I just don't know how to start, Jamie. Where do I find the motivation? And I always say, it's very simple. You don't have to find the motivation. Accountability and planning or what can get you on the track to success. So when I say accountability, that means a workout that has a start time. So whether you're signing up for a class at a gym or you're just taking a class on Zoom or perhaps just scheduling a walk with a friend, something with a start time can make all the difference. And then when we talk about planning, it can be as simple as putting out your gym clothes the night before, which we all heard, but I would say take it one step further. Pack your entire gym bag to make sure that you're not forgetting any of the little things that could end up becoming an excuse later. For instance, I always pack Neutrogena makeup remover towelette to my gym bag. Why? Forgetting a simple little thing like that could become my excuse to not work out because I wear makeup all the time. I don't want to have sweat and my makeup mix and destroy my skin. And I could say, oh, I forgot my cleanser. I'm just not going to work out. (laughs) <laughs> Remember these little odds and ends can make all the difference. So Neutrogena's makeup remover towelettes actually remove up to 30% more makeup than traditional liquid cleanser alone. So that's going to leave no trace behind. So you can go into your workout feeling confident. Okay. And finally, how do you get, uh, how do you make the choice of working out at home versus going to the gym of the studio now that they're open? 
Well, exactly. And some people just aren't quite there yet. They're not quite comfortable yet. And that's fair. So if you're in a place where you can go to a gym or perhaps there's an open air gym, which many places have done, terrific. But if you're still on kind of that at home workout vibe, that's cool too. And let me tell you, there's no reason for being at home or stuck at home to become an excuse why you wouldn't work out. There are so many great classes available on Zoom. And this is actually what I teach my coaching clients every day. I have a coaching practice called The Big Ask. And I teach people to quite simply ask for help. Because when you don't know where to start, you don't know where to start. And sometimes just asking for help and having that little measure of accountability is the strongest thing you can do. All right. My audience has gotten some good inspiration. Where do they go for more tips and some more concrete information like you've given us? Well, if you follow me at NYC Fit Fam on Instagram, I share tips and tricks like this every single day. Thank you for being my guest, Jamie Hess, today on the Bounder BB Show. Hi, I'm Bounder BB. I host the Bounder BB Show broadcast on radio and television. And this is my phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands free, pocket free, purse free, even belt free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com. <laughs> 